Let's get it done. Let's get it sorted. We had a great time yesterday. Um, it takes its sweet time doing the little animation thing in majiggy, but I think it's good now. Yeah, yeah, all right, sweet. G'day, legends. TJC Sports here. Welcome back to another NRL live stream reaction. As per usual, today we're here for the New Zealand Warriors versus the Newcastle Knights. Obviously, New Zealand hosting in their home country should be in for a great one. I hope you legends are having an absolutely brilliant Easter. Happy Easter, by the way, guys. Hope you guys are enjoying, whether it's a bunny or something as simple as like a chalky egg, I guess. Anything. And also just having a great day in general. Blessed bro to be alive. Let's go, guys. Really keen to get on with this game. If you enjoy, make sure you like and sub. But of course, this is just a very special day in general, eh, people? G Bunny says gray, mate. I hope you mean you probably mean good day, mate. But anyways, I'll say this I'll say what you typed. Gray mate. Gray mate, bro. Have a gray mate, bro. Have a brilliant time. Dude, have an amazing, exceptional moment. Obviously, guys, the New Zealand Warriors and the Newcastle Knights, the Warriors coming off a win 18-10 over the Raiders that was also on their home turf, but, of course, was a lot closer than they would have liked. And then also the Knights, they can't, they're they also coming off a win, but let's face it, the Storm were without, were without their two best halves. You can't exactly say it's a sign of the best things to come, so... We'll have to wait and see, but I personally think the Warriors should win this one well. It's early days, though. The game hasn't even kicked off yet, so I can't be making any assumptions yet, guys. Anyways, let's get on with the lineups. For the New Zealand Warriors, we have Roger Tuovasa-Shek at fullback. Oh, God, they've got two injuries at fullback. What will they do? They'll have to throw RTS into his best position, legends. Oh, no. With Dallin with ten years of Lesniak and Marcelo Montoya on the wings. Adam Pompey and Rocco Berry in the centers. The halves are Luke Metcalf and Sean Johnson. On the prop positions, we've got Adam Panua Blake and Mitchell Barnett. Wade Egan is the number nine. As for the second row, we have Jackson Ford and Kurt Catewell. Toru Harris is the lock and captain today. On the interchange, it's Morata Niakore, the former Paramatta Il, with Bunty Afoa, Jazz Tabunga, and Chanel Harris Tavita. Freddy Lussick is the 18th man. As for the Newcastle Knights, the visiting travelling team today, we have Kalen Ponga as the captain at fullback, with Thomas Jenkins and Inari Tuala in the, in the wings. Bradman Best and Dylan Lucas in the centres. Dylan Lucas filling in for. Um, Dane Gagai, who was out, Legends, big out there, but Dylan Lucas can more than fill a role. Tyson Gamble and Jack Cogger in the house. I still feel bad for Hastings that he's been dropped, but, you know, at the end of the day, the Knights have had to try something, and they just so happened to do it at the cost of Jackson Hastings. Saifidi and Daniel, both the Saifidi brothers line up in the prop positions, with the number nine being Phoenix Crossland. Tyson Prezell and Kai Pierce Pole are in the second row. Adam Elliott is at lock, and the interchange is Jaden Braley, Matt Croker, Jack Heverington, and Brody Jones. Jed Cartwright gets the 18th man position today. Looking at both sides, I think Warriors are clearly sh the should be winners in this one. But Newcastle guys, let's not forget what they showed they can do last year. And these two teams, this is a bit of a rematch. I believe it was Warriors that knocked out the Knights, wasn't it, in uh, finals? Though I could be going crazy. I'm pretty sure that's what happened. The Warriors knocked them out in a pretty good contest. Evening Legends, says Jason Reader. Evening, bro. Hello, Aussie bloke Craig. Welcome to the chat as always, mate. You're going up the Knights in this one. I'm going up the Wars in this. So we've got a bit of a rivalry between me and my own chat. Brilliant. Tyler, go Parramatta Eels tomorrow. Go Parramatta tomorrow, Liam. I'll be there blogging as always. Obviously, no Monday vlog because of that. I mean, not no Monday stream because of that, because I'll be vlogging, guys, unfortunately. So if you do love the streams, I just want to let you know that these two streams today will be the last ones for this round. So get behind us, guys. Get excited. Or hopefully, we should be in for a fun one. Adam O'Brien versus Webster. Who will reign supreme? Let's face it, Webster is probably the better coach of the two, in my opinion. But don't put it past O'Brien to possibly get a sneaky one over him here, legends. Warriors 1-12, to says Jason Reader. The New Zealand Warriors 1-12, to bro. I'm going 13-plus to the Warriors, but 1-12, to you know, maybe the Knights surprise us. I mean, this is the kind of round where anything could happen. I mean, the Dragons, you know, the Dragons did their upset. 
bit of bogey team central, isn't it? So maybe some surprises will happen. The Dogs had a close game versus the Bunnies. Um, you know, I think we could get a surprise where the Knights put up a fight or even win in this one, but I, I genuinely think that it should be a decent win for the New Zealand Warriors, guys. Jack Cogger, a decade-long journey to get here. He's not a young bloke, guys. He's taken a long time to get to this somewhat respected territory he's in. Up the Eels, boo Tigers, as Nelson and Beardets. Jason, um, Bunnies guy says, up the Tigers. Mate, up the Tiggies, up the Tiggies. Nah, 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 bro. Up the Eels, all right? I feel like public enemy number one. I get it, all right? I get it. We don't have Moses. But why does everybody, every single person want Parry to be miserable on Monday? It's crazy to me. It's just insane. It's like, what the heck, guys? You know, what did we do wrong to you guys to get deserving of this kind of treatment? Liam Pritchard says, Warriors by four, first try score at RTS. Everyone's going close. I just don't think it will be, but... Maybe you guys are right. Maybe you're right. I mean, you know, rugby league, it's that kind of game where it could happen. Warriors, bro. RTS is my anytime. I hope he gets a try because of the fact that he is in my um, predictions, all right? He is in my super coach as well as captain. I've got him there, guys. Um, I'm glad that I only vice captained um, Tommy Turbo because he did awfully in my super coach. It's just a real relief for me. I'm really happy with how it turned out overall guys having a look right now i'm just kind of trying to scroll through see who could be some key players in this game here remember guys after this stream we have the cronella sharks and the canberra raiders rts you know obviously there bradman best dylan lucas uh, i'll go dylan lucas also anytime all right so two backs and then we'll say you know no i'll do i'll go dylan lucas first I got Dylan Lucas first try scorer. Crazy, pr I know, guys. Dylan Lucas first try scorer, and uh, I'll say that the anytime try scorer for the for the Knights will be Kai Pierce Paul. Kai Pierce Paul's gonna rock over Legends. First try scorer RTS anytime Kalen Ponga. Anytime Kalen Ponga, bro. Both the fullbacks, they're going to rock over, guys. They're going to rock it through. Rocket Roger and Kalen the Pong are going to hop up over the defense and stop them. Nothing will be able to get in their way. Oh, I can't stop me now. It'll be like, up the mighty wise has got to hear. That's right, legend. That's what we like to hear. A little bit passion for your team. Come on, get a little bit in there, guys. Little bit. We're less than 10 minutes away from the game, so surely you guys are a little keen, right? Whether you're a Warriors or a Newcastle Knights fan, surely you're excited and hopeful for your team in this one, guys. Peter Gow is the um, referee today. I don't know how you guys feel about him, but trust me, at least he's not Ashley Klein. Um, Katuka says, I'm at the game in my mind at home. I'm at the game in my mind at home. Ah, okay. I was, I had to reread uh, a second so I could fully get a picture of it. Yeah, so you're at home and you're thinking about it as if you're at the game. Go into my fridge, empty, damn. Oh, my God. I know the feeling. When your fridge is empty, it's not a fun time, is it, Legends? It's not a fun time when your fridge is empty. But, you know, it happens to a lot of people. And hopefully at least they give you something to be happy about, right? Hopefully we get a good win here, okay? Just do it for Kotoku Waz. Do it for them. Do it. For them, Warriors, get it going, mate. Prove up the Waz, mate. The up the Waz, Waz bandwagon will fall apart if they don't go back soon to their winning ways. Remember, guys, the Warriors bandwagon is something else, I swear. Kickoff is next. Warriors v Knights Legends. Not long now. There's about seven minutes, I'd like to say, until we kick off with this one. Uh, smash that like button, guys. Absolutely make sure you smash that like button. We're right around the corner with it. And I've been all Blake, Jacob, Saifidi. Honestly, I think I've just got RTS in this one, right? I'll take a look again at my... Um, like, all that really matters for me in these kind of games is Supercoach, to be honest, you know? Um, it's all, it's re very much just me enjoying the game outside of that when it comes to it. Because it doesn't personally impact me, especially not this early on in the season. Um... This early on in the season, you can't exactly say, I want this team to win so my team does better. It's way too early for that. Where's Benji in the bin? Get Benji in the bin, bro. Get Benji in the bin. Why isn't Benji in the bin already, Legends? He should be sitting there right now. He should be ashamed, bro. Get out of here. Benji in the bin, Legends. Oh, my God. Bostock, 87 for me. To be fair, 70 of that was in the first half. So, God, he only got 17 in the second yesterday. RTS, hopefully, going to have a ripper. Then Nico Hines versus the Raiders. Hopefully he has a crazy one too. 
Oh, Morgan Smithies. Yeah, I've got a couple next game, but for this one, it, it quite literally is just RTS Legends. Hunger Strike to a Waz win by 30 points. Mate, the Waz winning by 30 points. That's what we need. The Waz, guys. Can the Warriors do it? Just for Katuku, guys. Dedicate the victory to him. Put your heart on your chest, bro. Come on. TJC, there's a ton. Oh, no, Legend. Oh, no, Anaranth MBS. I can't believe it. <laughs> Oh, ouch. Boom. Hurt so bad, man. Hurt so bad, that bomb. Jeez. EOS 13 plus tomorrow. Jason Reader, I do hope so, man. I'm very hopeful tomorrow, Legends. I know that a lot of people are going out West Tigers, but I'm hopeful for my side, all right? I'm glad when the Tigers win. I just don't want it to be against my team. <laughs> I feel like a lot of people can relate to that kind of card. It's just like, I want you to win a little more than you do, but please don't let it be against my side. Please don't let it ruin my day. Ruin someone else's day, not mine. I support you when you when you um, are my losing. Come on, man. Come on, Tigers. What the actual heck? You're making you're making the other supporters sad, Legend. You're making the other supporters sad, devastated, Legends. Hi, Santa. Hello, mate. Hello, bro. Hello. Don't know why you call me Santa, but I'll take it. I'll take it, Legend. It's a name. I'll give you that much. It's certainly a name. That's all I'll give it, though. It's a name for me. That's simply it. Knights 13 plus is Viking Axe. Really? Really, Viking Axe? If Knights 13 plus, I really thought Warriors would be a shoe in in terms of who you'd want to tip. But this season doesn't really go how it should in your head, right? So maybe, Legend, maybe the Knights put it out of here and Viking Axe is just a genius. Raiden Goddard says, what is your score prediction tomorrow? Mine is Eels 48, um, Tiger 16, go Eels, man. Go Eels, Braden Goddard. Go the Eels, brother. I, myself, will go with the Eels 24 to the Tiger 16. There's my scoreline, guys, okay? Eels will score 24 points. The Tigers will score 16 and will lose to us. They might even be up like 16 to 10 at one point, the Tigers, but we will win in the end, legend. Where's the old hat, TJC? Well, mate, the old hat has been retired ever since the end of last season, mate. The entirety of this year, we've been wearing this new blue one because every single year we wear the um, current membership hat. Last year, the white hat was the membership hat. This year, the blue hat is the membership hat. Every year, I wear the membership hat. It's kind of my thing. I've been doing it since 2022. That was the 2023 hat right there, the white one. I had the 2022 blue one that's somewhere away too that was retired for the white hat the previous year. That white hat has now been retired, and we're on to this blue hat here, legend. We're eating a village at the round table tonight because we've taken over the castle. Come on, Katuku, mate. The castle, bro. You'll you'll loot all of their food. Pillage, mate, the shelves. Get through the storage. Go into the basement. Get out the supplies. Get out the backstop and just absolutely clean them dry, mate. That's what you're going to do against them. Half 16, bro. Mate, what do you mean half 16? Legend, what do you mean half 16? 27 votes so far, guys. What Injury forces, yes, obviously Cardi Party's gone. I know that much. Let me actually take a look at how they've changed that, actually, to be honest. This is my personal kind of preference, guys. Both teams in the sheds right now, the Knights and the Waz, having their little last talk, their team talk. Arms in here, boys. Get ready for a massive one, guys. I'm just too quickly taking a look at my bar. I'm curious how they pulled out Cardi, who they put him in, put in. Yeah, they put in Tualangi. I did say, guys, I did say it. Um, you can find it, I'm sure. I did say Tualangi will be probably be my favourite to fill in because Maddo's so focused on being a log. So, yep, it seems like I've been proven correct and Tualangi will be starting for Parramatta. Boom. That's tomorrow, though. For today, we have the Wars and the Knights. The Newcastle Knights are coming through the Sheds, Legends. Get ready. Whether you're a Newey fan or a Wa fan, you've got to be excited. Happy Easter, ladies and gentlemen. The fans show up in widespread here for what should be a great affair. Newcastle, Kalen Ponga and RTS battling in the fullback positions. A little bit since Rocket Rogers really got in his chance. When he was at fullback versus the Raiders, when injury happened, he was brilliant. Hopefully he can continue it today. Um, Braden Goddard says halftime, Eels 10, 
um, 16 Tigers, full time 48 16. You think the Eels will come back in the second half, bro? We run away in the second half. Br brilliant, Braden Goddard. I hope that you're right, man. Come on, bro. I hope you're right. Rush the gate, swim the chat. No, climb the wall, claim the castle, rewrite the kingdom, royalty warriors. Remember, knights, they may serve, but warriors lead, legends. And the warriors, will they lead in this game? Good luck against Tigers, TJC. My prediction, Eels 20, Tigers 40. Sorry, bro, but I'm tipping the ref for this game. Bruh, bruh, 40. Eels are a better team than the Tigers. I don't get this. Eels are a better team. Then the Tigers. I'm losing my mind here. The Tigers, maybe they beat us, but they are not this infinitely better 13 plus team over the Eels, bro. NRL has says, no, Cardi Party. Well, mate, Cardi Party was announced injured for like almost the whole week now. It was actually weird that he was named. Most Eels fans shouldn't have expected him to be playing, and he's expectedly been pulled out. So, Kelma Tuolangi will be playing. Kelma's a great player, so I don't actually mind it too much. But it will be a player we miss. You know, it's better having both than neither. So, yeah, it will be sad. But at the end of the day, Kelma will fill in just fine, legend. Mate, I just don't get the hate on Para, but we'll see. We'll see tomorrow. It's all good, mate. I just don't get it. <laughs> All right, we're just waiting on the final whistle from the referee, and we'll finally get underway, guys. Have you, make sure you got your eggs, your bunnies, and everything ready, guys, as we kick off here. Happy Easter, ladies and gentlemen. The first half of our first game is underway. Now, Adam Panor Blake going down the left here. I will be I will be at the game vlogging, Legend, because as I've said many times on the channel, I vlog every single home game and will be going to majority of away games. I'm only missing three or four Eels games this year. I'm going to most of them. So, don't be excited. Majority of Eels games will be vlogs, dude. Now, the New Zealand Warriors on the third tackle. Back over to Tohu Harris. Tohu Harris with the spin. Stop hating on Perro, mate. And then over to the left, right. Paris then held. Back to Egan. Egan then to RTS. RTS now flipping in the script over to the 40 meter. Mate, they cannot like Para, mate. I have no... NRL's and MBS, bro. I have no issue with them not liking Para, mate. Mate, okay? They're fine, legend. They're fine not tipping Para. It's just, um, I don't get it. But it's their opinion, mate. We're a channel that believes in opinion. So they won't be timed out, mate. And I hope you don't time them out. Newcastle Knights. Knights almost to the halfway line here. On to the second tackle now. Phoenix Crossland now with the pass. Off over to Bradman Best. Bradman Best will be hoping to improve upon a lackluster start to the season. Moves over the halfway line here. Crossland now. Short over to Saifiti. Seems like an interesting bit that they've decided to put both Saifiti brothers in the starting prop positions. Maybe they're trying to get a bit of a connection there going like Burgess brothers kind of. Now Caelan Ponga. Back over, Newcastle Knights, running through Dylan Lucas. Dylan Lucas with the squeeze, Dylan Lucas held back. Then Caelan Ponga, Tyson Gamble kicks high, and Warriors collect, man. I know they're annoying, bro, but mate, 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 mate. We can't be, we can't be favouring just our own team, bro. It's called a all fans channel, not just a, it's not just a Parramatta Eels fan channel, and it's an MD edits, mate. What you need to look out for is people swearing and putting down the channel. That is where you actually mod, bro. All right, and I just want to say, mate, you need to do you need to do your thing, mate. As a mod, it's not just a it's not just a gift to you. You got to be a mod, bro. New Zealand Warriors, Rocco Berry, jo Sean Johnson now taking the kick on the fifth here. Hello, Dean, love stuff, bro. Allowed to bounce here with the Newcastle Knights. Then Greg Marju. No, not Greg Maju. Um, Anari Tuala can collect. Anari Tuala now held down. Jack Cogger then. Cogs over to the right. Yeah, up the eels, mate. Up the eels, bro. I know that, mate. Then the Knights. New Zealand Warriors now running back on side here. We came back from 14 last week, so hopefully we defend tomorrow. I will keep my prediction. Mate, yeah, you came back from 14, bro. 100% the Parramatta Eels can do it tomorrow, but um, we're not talking about para today, legends. Now the New Zealand Warriors. Moving down the middle, Wade Egan here. We're not even five minutes in, guys, and already the New Zealand Warriors have found their way. First tackle here, RTS now. Roger Tulvasa Shek looking for the run. Ro Roger Tulvasa Shek flipped over. Then Adam Fanua Blake. Adam Fanua Blake with the flip, 
Adam Fanua Blake actually had a really good start to his try scoring, which tries in his first, what was it, two out of the three games they've played, four games they've played possibly. Sean Johnson then. Back over to Kate, Kate Well. Kurt Kate Well, guys, on the thumbnail today. Can he do something? Can he get a try for the New Zealand Warriors? Toe Harris now. They've only got one more tackle after this, so make the most of it. Adam Fanua Blake now. Fanua Blake, desperate to try and find the pass. What is it, Dean? Love stuff, mate. Sh now, back to Sean Johnson. And Sean Johnson kicks high here. Which chases the Warriors. Here we have it. Rocco Berry. Is it a try? Does the referee give it? We're going up to the we're going up to the bunker. The referee has no try, legends. We'll have to wait and see. Mate, Brandon's going for para two. Brandon, mate, Brandon's going for para two. Don't know what you're talking about there, and it's in ads, bro. Yeah. Oh, it could be a knock on into Ponga, bro. It could be a knock-on into Ponga for them, Legends, if I'm being honest, looking at it. It might not be what they wanted. <laughs> I'm not so certain with this one that it's going to be a um, that it's gonna be a try. You could argue head-head, but, like, his hand hits it into his head and then back over, and then he collects. Is it a juggle, or is it a, It feels like it's into, bro. Yeah, and it should... It probably isn't a try there, Legends. Mate, and there you go. No, no try, legends. Unfortunately, Rocco Berry will not get the cherry of a try there. Rocco Berry, legends, unfortunately, will not be getting the chance to put his team in the lead. The Newcastle Knights will get the ball back. It was hit into the Knights in the defence, so no try there, legends. Newcastle Knights now short over to Jack Cogger. Jackie Boy Cogger. Down the middle. Just kidding. There's only one Jackie boy, and his name's Jack White. And Phoenix Crossland now with a line ball pass over to the left here. Then held down over by the Warriors. Then Crossland gets it to Adam Elliott. Now Saifiti. Daniel Saifiti. Well, what? Well, that would not be a knock on if it's into someone's face. It is only a knock on if it hits. It's the ground, but yes, no try. No, no, mate. What I mean is that you can't lose the ball into a player and then recollect it, bro. That's not how it works, man. That's not how it works. You can't. Okay, I'm not even going to talk about that, but you can't, legend. You can't lose the ball into a. Yeah. Now, okay, the Warriors continue on here. And now we got a penalty, guys. Under five minutes, a penalty. The Newcastle Knights screaming their head off as the Warriors get it. Offside, inside the 10 metres. Here we have it. Sean Johnson now. Taking the kick. Come on, legends. Are you going to tomorrow game or live streaming? I did just... I, I'm pretty sure I answered that before, legend. I'm going to the game. I'm going to the game and I'm vlogging, mate, because I go to every single Parramatta Eels home game. And I also go to majority of away games. I'm only missing about three or four games this season. Warriors. Johnson to Adam Fanua Blake. Adam Fanua Blake with the with the twirl there. Tutorangi Hokumau. Apologies if I didn't pronounce that right. I was trying, legend. Says up the mighty Warriors. That's the passion legend. Get me on your team. Up the mighty Warriors. Tutorangi bro. Then over to the right Toyo Harris. Then to SJ. Back over to Kurt Catewell. Kurt Catewell. Yes, you are right. I'm not arguing with you, but you caught put it a knock on. I was just saying it was not, but I don't know what what you call it. To be honest, mate, I call it a hit. I I call it lot. Well, I could technically say a loss of possession into the player, but a knock on is a simpler way of saying lost the ball. So that's just what I called it. To be simplistic, it's not an argument, man. I know that. I'm just saying, it's not an argument. It's just in a. It's just a way I said it to shorten it because it's just you got to think quickly when you're streaming. Newcastle Knights now managed to get the ball back here. I just don't even want to focus too much on silly stuff. Back over Tuala, guys. Tuala with the koala, bro. The koala there. Can we call Tuala the koala with the tackle? Then over the Jenkins. Thomas Jenkins here. A pretty nothing signing, many said. Maybe he can prove us wrong soon. Just sound stop. So just... Then. Then down the middle. Down the middle, held down here. Then over to the right, Phoenix Crossland, back to Saifiti. Daniel Saifiti then pushing forward here. 
Saifiti then with the flip. Now, the, the sound's still there. I just checked, man. The sound's still there. The sound's still there, mate. I just checked it out for you. I was like, whom is he right? No, the sound's still there for me. Then over to the right here. Dallin with 10 years of Lesniak, guys. DWZ. DWZ takes the hit. Then SJ back to RTS. RTS back over to the middle. RTS looks to find his way through the gap. Remember, guys, Rocket Roger for a reason. When he finds his way through one of those gaps, it's one of the best plays you'll see. Then to Adam Penor Blake. AFB, guys. A freaking... Mate, a bloody good player there. Back to SJ. SJ. Back to Barnett. 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 Hard net there. Takes the tackle over there. Newcastle Knights. They'll want to defend this one. The Warriors so far with the good start. Kalen Ponga collects. Now Kalen Ponga down the right edge here. Kalen Ponga into the line. Gets held down here. It was me. My iPad just connected to my headphones randomly. Oh, apologies for that, Legend. Sorry to hear that. Hopefully, um, you can re Hopefully, you can still hear me now, though, Legend, uh, mate. Newcastle Knights taking the tackle. The Knights here, they, they haven't had the start they would have wanted in this season. But, you know, it is early days. And I can't say that forever. But for now, I can say it is early days, Legends. Kalen Ponga, back to Adam Elliott. Adam, El Adam Elliott over. No, it isn't NRL. It's an NBA edit. TJC is my um, initials, which doesn't work with J. Um, it would be JTC if those were my initials, if, if um, that was the case. It's TJC. So, no, that's not my name. It's just a name some call me, just like how you call me Santa Legend. Newcastle Knights. Back over. DWZ. Dallin with 10 years of Lesniak. Bursting through the line here. Supersonic style. The Knights keeping him out here. The Warriors, guys, up the wire. The wagon really grew last year. I wouldn't say it's like the Pampers wagon where it's just no logic to it, but it certainly grew a lot more the moment that the Warriors started to do well. But, you know, credit to the New Zealand fans. Always love running into them. General, genuinely a good, fun time when you run into them for the most part. And Metcalf gets smashed there by Tyson Frizzell, guys. Tyson Frizzell with the beautiful hit there. And, oh, no, Metcalf's down, Legends. Metcalf can't get up. Metcalf's not looking right, guys. What the actual heck, guys? Tyson Frizzell with the brutal one on him, showing a bit of his NRL experience there. One of the older players around on the field taking it. Metcalf just taking the bottle, making sure he's all right. There's a Tommy on you. Mate, NRL's NBA edits, mate. I can only so many times go, oh no, boom. Almost 10 minutes gone by, Legends, in this game so far. Warriors, Newcastle. Honestly, I'm more so looking forward to the next game, you know. For some reason, Raiders and that gets me really hyped. But this one is still fun, you know. The Warriors overall have been the better side to start off, though. Okay, the Newcastle Knights have not switched on to the point that I think some expected. It is early days, though. Only nil-nil. Nobody's actually scored yet, but I'm very much back in the um, my was tip at this point in time. 34 votes now so far on the stream legends. And looks like Metcalf's going to be coming off legends due to that hit. And now coming onto the field will be Chanel Harris-Tavita for the New Zealand Warriors people. What a hit from Frizzell. Nothing wrong with that. That was just a brutal hit. That's what we want to see in our game. Some heavy smashes, guys, but not like not like illegal, not above the head. Just like some good legal, you know, round the hips, hit them to the ground, just, oh. Unfortunately, he just got a little unlucky there, Metcalf, and terrible, a terrible way to start his Easter. Now the Warriors, though, they won't get much of a chance from it here as they just have to clear it. Caleb Pogger! Pogger's going down the line! Pogger, here he goes! Pogger, here he goes! Caleb Pogger held down now. Now over to the right. Jack Cogger back. Marju. Greg Marju down. Going, charging forward here. Greggy Marju stops. Phoenix Crossland then. Over to Cogger. Cogger to Gamble. Jenkins now. Thomas Jenkins with the sprint there. Thomas Jenkins then held down here. Then Gamble. 
to Frizzell. Tyson Frizzell earlier with the brilliant tackle. The New Zealand Warriors just keeping him out here. Crossing and then back to the left. Crossing it to Cogger. Jack Cogger now. Oh, the momentum. Caleb Pogger. Bradman Best. Tuala's running. And Nari Tuala. And Nari Tuala now. Nari Tuala now held. Back to Bradman Best. Caleb Pogger. Fifth tackle. Ten metre line. They kick and chase down the middle. And Jackson Ford will collect. Going forward. Wood. Now the Warriors guys pull the counter in. Oh, bad play of the ball. Bad play of the ball potentially. And no. The referee will be giving a penalty to the New Zealand Warriors. Adam Elliott screaming at the referee, but it will not matter. It's going against his team whether he likes it or not. The, Sean Johnson here, very keen to get this underway. Come on, guys. Surely we're going to be see, seeing a try soon with the momentum here. The big back and forth, the quick sprint, sprinting. Clearly, the Newcastle Knights have switched on the moment that I said they hadn't started well. Now, the Warriors, guys, getting to restart the play here. Down at the middle is is um, Rocco Berry. He got a try disallowed earlier. Maybe he can find a try later. Unfortunate for him because he did definitely put in a good effort for it. Um, is your mum home? Mate, my, 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 my. Yes, yes, yes. Adam Fanua Blake. Egan to Harris. Toe Harris now. Harris with the arms out. The arms bolded from the Knights as they hold him back. The Newcastle Knights defending their castle here. Oh, Adam Fanua Blake pulls off a little bit of a dummy, but of course, he's no 5'8", so there's no immediate 20 metre sprint to be had there. Now back over. Egan to RTS to Rocco Berry. Off the night, it was a charge down, which makes it completely legal to chase from the Newcastle Knights. And wait, now the referee's stopping the play. Was it just a knock-on, actually? Yeah, no, it was a knock-on. It wasn't a charge down. Anari Tuala Legends just going for the tackle, coming off him, making it a knock-on, guys. So the New Zealand Warriors will be getting the feed here in the scrum. This should be a chance right on the 20-meter to make something of it. Let's go, Legends. Chanel, Harris, Tavita. Egan, over to the left here. Gets it to SJ. Back over. Oh, honestly, mate, you know, um, I do. I did tell you, mate, in a previous stream, so you should listen to me, that I uh, come from a para-supporting family, so obviously my mother is an Eels fan, and she loves talking and replying to me because of the fact that she's a big big supporter, and is really happy with the channel, okay, she's just a supportive mother, now, I'd rather not, I'd rather not make it an entire conversation, and it's an NBA edits, bro, okay, mate, like, let's ask some rugby league questions, and do you the modding, asking about his family members, dude, like, I, I feel really uncomfortable talking about my family non-stop, RTS, okay, now, Toe Harris, Harris, guys, into the line. Toe Harris, Newcastle Knights holding him back here. Newcastle Knights legends. Back over, good pass, the number nine, and Toe Harris collects. Toe Harris manages to get the ball. Yeah, oh, you know what, mate? Enter out an NBA at its bro. Um, yeah, sorry, mate. Had to be done. All right, guys, the Warriors hold him back. Simply just put him in timeout for um for five. Put him in timeout for five minutes because you know what, Aussie blo bloke, I I'm not gonna put up with that. Okay, the Knights guys, Kalen Pogi here. Over down the middle, Saifiti, Daniel Saifiti now held back. Then over Phoenix Crossland to the left here where we got Frizzell in support here. Tyson Frizzell held back, Legends. Over to the 40 finally. Newcastle Knights, guys, one more tackle. They've only gained 28 metres in this set here. Not their best set they've ever had. And now the Warriors collect. Dallin with 10 years of Lesniak, guys. He's got speed in him. Speed to burn, Legends. Pushes himself over to the 20 metre line. Aussie bloke, Craig, don't worry. I sorted it. Legends, mate. Appreciate you stepping in, though, bro, and doing your moderating job. Marcelo Montoya here. Thank you, Aussie. Thank you, Aussie, man. I do appreciate it. 
Adam Pompey. I'm glad that you agree I made the right decision there. Unfortunately, it just had to be done. Now down the far left here, we got a six again going, Legends. It, ruck in for Regmont there. Sean Johnson back to Mitch Barnett. Mitchie Barnett, guys. I love saying Mitch Barnett. There's something about it. Mitchie, guys. There's only one Mitchie for me, and that's Mitch Moses. But Mitchie Barnett, you know, he can do it, mate. He can do it in that prop position. I believe he's a former Newcastle Knight as well, which is pretty big for him. Added for Nua Blake. What a smash through the line there. Now back Wade Egan. Will you back Egan? Oh, Jackson Ford. Never mind back in Egan. Back that pass. Jackson Ford running over like the company itself. The Ford is over. The Ford gets it into high gear, pulls the lever, and goes full point. It is 4-0. Get rid of that still no points, Aussie Blake Craig. It is 4-0 now to the New Zealand Warriors. Jackson Ford puts his team in the front, moving forward here. The former St. George Illawarra Dragon, the team that won yesterday against Manly 20-6. to 20 to 6. Incredible try there. It's all wins in every world. Jackson Ford wins this week. Brilliant legends. That is how we do it. Come out firing. Okay, so as soon as I say, say no points, they get points. Exactly, ma'am. Aussie, say there's no points more often so we can have more tries like that. Jackson Ford, legends. Say it. Say it more, guys. Aussie bloke Craig says every other game this round has started with one side coming out on fire and getting points, mate. Every other game, legend. Every other second game, it happens, bro. Every, but this one, this one's different. We're not going to start off with a fire. We're going to have a bit of a low-scoring one, but we're going to enjoy it. You know, they're giving, they're easing us into it because of Easter, guys. Because it's Easter, the bunny doesn't want to, the bunny doesn't want to make it, you know, end too quickly, guys. The game, the bunny here. Speaking of which, Mr. Easter Bunny, will we be seeing you at halftime? You heard it here first, folks. We might be seeing Mr. Easter Bunny at halftime. <laughs> Jax is watching this while fishing at a lake. What what do in this game? Well, right now, the Warriors just get the lead, man. I hope the fishing's going well, bro. Let us know if you catch anything, man. Come on, Jackie, mate. Love seeing you in the chat, bro. With the kick here, Sean Johnson, ladies. And gentlemen, the number seven to make it six. He does it. Luke Metcalf, you may have come off, come off the field. The number six. But we'll get six points for you. Six nil, ladies and gentlemen. Warriors take the lead in this one. Well, come on. Watching this game. Watching this game. Mate, I wish you were watching it proper. Are you watching it while, like, the stream as well? Or, like, are you just jumping into the stream to celebrate? Because, bro, 100%, let us know if you catch a fish, mate. We can celebrate. We can be like, you caught a fish, bro, on Easter. Brilliant. It's the greatest thing known to man, dude. You might even have catched some now. Bloody nearly got an eel tail catfish, but he but he took me in, into a snag. No. No. We would have loved you to get an eel tail catfish, bro. The silly little guy took you into a snag, bro. Well, you'll get one eventually, Jack. I believe in you. You've got the power of the legends on your side, mate. That is something that you cannot um, you cannot argue or challenge. The power of the legends is with you, and they're going to get you there. You're going to get yourself a fish soon, mate. Uh, bloody nearly got an eel catfish, but he took me into a... Yeah, sorry, not that. Beautiful kick. Oh, mate, it was a spectacular kick. I loved it as a kick there, the guys, to make it 6-0. 20 minutes almost gone by. Added Vanua Blake now. Down the middle here. The hay diddle fiddle. The Newcastle Knights holding him back. The brother Daniel Saifidi. Shot down low. We call them a, do a do tail catfish where I'm from. Mate, I like the eel. I like the eel parts. I like the eel part. Speaking of liking, I love that from Chanel Harris Davida. Chanel Harris Davida. Goes over for the Warriors, and the Warriors will score again in their home ground. The New Zealand Warriors! And the Newcastle Knights could not stop them. The run from Egan over to him was just spectacular. Brilliant stuff. What a dummy from Egan. Daniel Saifidi, what are you doing? What are you doing? Ridiculous. And that is not what you want to be seeing. They play the Dragons next week. 
But weed misses like that in the defense. How do they expect to defend? How do they expect to defend legends? How? I wish we could take screenshots and send them in the chat. Oh, Jack, I wish to. Hey, 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 hey. If you look. If you like do mate if you love taking um screenshots bro just take screenshots put on insta mate i'll be like highlights from tjc sports me just being like oh you know on stream or something dude going crazy mate going all out for this thing all right guys and it is 12 nil to the warriors because of course you know both tries pretty much right in front in the easiest kicks of their life 12 nil the scoreline now if they score next, it's going to be 13 plus. 38 votes so far, Legends, on the uh, poll. Rubbing my hands together in anticipation for what the rest of this game could bring. <sighs> I'm rubbing my hands together, just really hopeful that we get something even bigger in this game here. All right, guys, now the Newcastle Knights take the kick here, and it ends up with Mitch Barnett. Mitchy Barnett, you're opening us out here. Do them proud, Barnett. Go, man. Run. 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 Go, bro. Then down the left. Craig, I think I had the catfish on, and then he took me in a snag and spat the bait. <laughs> Far out, Jack. That's ridiculous. That's absolutely ridiculous, Jack, mate. I feel for you, bro. Hopefully, mate, 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 okay. Let's hope that doesn't happen again. Damn, Catfish knew. It knew you were after it, Jack. Oh, sounds like it. It's all good, Arrows NBA. So I do forgive you. I do forgive you. But, like, yeah, I don't, I don't put up with the... I don't put up with stuff. You know, there was a time where I did and it just ruined it for a lot of people. Newcastle Knights now collect. I, I do. I forgive you, bro. And I'm not one to hold grudges, usually. I'm not one to hold grudges. And the Newcastle Knights here. And we got a penalty here for the Knights, guys. <laughs> Slowing play of the ball. The Newcastle Knights get themselves a penalty. This is just what they needed to hopefully bounce back in this one, guys. All right, Newcastle on the 30 meter. Bradman Best. Bradman Best forcing himself back over. Gets himself to the 40 meter let now crossland then over far to Koga Koga then to Saifiti here Saifiti then Phoenix crossland crossland crossing it over to Elliot Elliot over now gamble and Frizzell collects Tyson Frizzell legends the Newcastle Knights they're halfway through their set they've gotten to the 40 if they can gain a little more meters maybe they could do something Kalen Ponga now Kalen Ponga trying to squeeze through, but the Warriors just too tight nicked in that defensive line. Um, they're legends. Adam Elliott then, just Daniel Saifiti. Daniel Saifiti then. Daniel Saifiti, Crossland then, over to the right. Jack Cogger Cogs. Oh, come on, catch it. And RTS manages to collect. Now back over Marcelo Montoya here, guys. Montoya with the sprint and the flip. Chanel Harris to beat her. He got the try earlier. Now passing it off. All right, guys. We officially have news on Luke Metcalf's injury. He is ruled out with a right shin injury, legends. He is ruled out with a right shin injury. The Warriors then. DWZ. DWZ held back down. Back to Mitch Barnett. Mitch Barnett. Barnett finds the pass against his former team, Deshaun Johnson. Kurt Catewell. Kurt Catewell flicks back to Rocco Berry. Rocco Berry then. Rocco Berry with the with the pass gets it. Then SJ. Fifth kick tackle clear. The clearance gets it to the 20. No, it doesn't. It ends up back. It's hit backwards by Newcastle. And Kalen Ponga there really struggles to collect it. Probably way too much for what he should have. But he does just about get there and gets held down with it. Alrighty, legends, we're still very much into this one, as it seems. Newcastle Knights then, Thomas Jenkins. Thomas Jenkins then, down the right bit, 30-meter line here. 
Then over to the left where we have Tyson Frizzell. Tyson Frizzell then. Jackson Ford holding him off with Marcelo Montoya here. The New Zealand Warriors, I'm very happy with them, you know, with the fan base they have. The improvement has been unreal. What a run down the right edge. Let go. Go, Maju and Helder. Oh, you are kidding. My, oh my goodness, my. And the Knights, despite the chances, had a brother. Oh. Alright guys, 20 meter line here, here we go, DWZ, now Dallin with 10 years of Lesniak, taking the, um, taking the hit here, stopped on the 20, Kai Pierce pole there, with the tack, with the, um, with the tackles, legends, Adam Pompey, 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 I love it, Pompey, that was the last day bro, love it, love it as a second, anyway. Now back over down the middle here. Seems like Ozzy really knows his fishing uh, from what I'm randomly glancing at in the chat. RTS now, the number one. Roger Tuvasa Shek forces them over the halfway line here. Come on, Rocket Roger. Do a little more, bro, as my super coach captain. Added Padua Blake now with the spin and the twirl. Almost on the 30, but he couldn't give it enough of a whirl. Wade Egan, dummies. His dummy earlier created a brilliant try. Caleb Ponga, guys, in all the right positions. Ponga is where Latrell needs to be more for his team. Ponga, guys, he's running past every warrior. Caleb Ponga running. Caleb Ponga what running. Brilliant there from him. Then over to Bradman Best. Bradman Best getting himself over to the halfway line. Oh, and our other 10B edits. Um... Mate, we'll discuss, um, can you give me, can you give me a little bit to think, bro, honestly, um, I could give you mod, I could give you mod, but like, are you gonna be a mod this time, because it's not just something where you have mod, and you can have fun with it, it's something, or like, just ban people, because, you know, they don't like power, it's one of those things where you've got to, um, do the job of modding, do you promise to do it actual modding, because I feel like the first time round you didn't really do it like you really should have. Okay? You promise, bro? You promise? You can, I don't know, it's a, you can check when you buy them, Jack, they aren't really expensive. It's not about if you're a normal person, bro, it's about doing a, it's about doing, I, I know you're a normal mate. It's not about if you're yes, you gotta do the job of modding. Alright? If you don't do your job as a mod, then you don't be okay. Your last chance, mate. Your last chance and it's not about normal people, bro. By the way, I am a little disappointed that if you don't wouldn't be mate. As a mod, you should be in this stream whether you're a mod or not, mate. You shouldn't only want to be here because you're a mod. That's my only issue, all right? So be better in the future, bro. Bradman Best. Bradman Best over the 30 meter here. Thomas Jenkins. Thomas Jenkins now. Thomas Jenkins takes the tackle here for New Zealand. I want to see Jack cheering, say you got a fish soon, and then a pick on Insta for us to see. Mate, I really hope Aussie Bloke Craig. I've been thinking about it ever since I heard Jack talk about it. I've been thinking about him going, please, man, do it. Good day, TJC and all the legends in here. What a fast-paced game we have right now, eh? Oh, absolutely, William Hunt. It's really fast-paced right now. We're going right down both ends here. It's really quickly, actually. The New Zealand Warriors having to think faster on their feet to be able to stop the Newcastle Nice, the Wilds are playing really well, bro. Ah, oh, the catfish keeps pulling bread, bread off, but the hook set is too late to hook them on. Mate, mate, maybe you got to adjust what you're doing right there now, mate. And oh my goodness, one ball collected by Croker. Croker held down. Warriors are looking good this season. Mate, they looked good last season. Honestly, I think the Warriors are a finals team, but um, they got very unlucky early on. They definitely have looked very good. Okay, I haven't seen the Warriors look poor. They may have started 0-2, but... Um, I could hardly say they've been as bad as other teams that hadn't won till that point yet. Right. My fave phrase is up the wires. Mate, we all love saying up the wires. It's a pretty fun saying, legends. Warriors 12, Knights nil, legends. 30 minutes almost gone by in this game. More like 20 mi 28 minutes and a half right now, but still. 
bread and pounding them into dough. Warriors 12, Knights nil. The Newcastle Knights, will they be able to find something soon? Now, Bunty Afoa starting the play here. Jackson Ford then. Jackson Ford taking them on. Obviously, Jackson Ford, he scored arguably the best try. What a run from him, the second row forward there. I want an absolute sprint across the field, Legends. That's what I want. I want a brilliant run. I want to try for the ages, you know. And we almost got that um, early on the Friday with the incredible stop from Tommy Dearden, was, wasn't it? Yeah, Tom Dearden. Brilliant stop there. What a try saver. One of the best around Legends. That can work. That can work, man. But it is risky. Bread bread gets soggy and falls off. Next time, make some dough and add extra sugar to make it sweet. Fish will love it and it won't go soggy. Aussie bloke Craig, mate, giving us the fishing tips for everybody in the chat, mate. That's how you do it. See, Aussie bloke knows where it's at, bro. Knows where it's at, how to do it. You get out to teach you what to do. Good on your dad for teaching you, bro. Now the Newcastle Knights, guys, pushing themselves up. Jack Colger. Passes back to the left. Obviously, Jack Cogger, guys, premiership winner with the Penrith Panthers. He has a lot to prove here. He brings a winning mentality to the Knights that they surely lacked in previous seasons in the past. Besides last season, where they obviously bounced back a lot more than before. Chase, 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 ignore the haters and be the best YouTuber. Exactly, mate. Exactly. All right. Takes the penalty kick here and ends up on the 35 meter line. Bradman Best now to... Kai Pierce Paul now. Kai Pierce Paul get pushing it over. Goes past. They're not even quite at the halfway line yet, but this set is looking promising, guys. I've got a feeling about it. Ponga now gets it back. Dylan Lucas with the push. I was very wrong tipping Dylan Lucas for first try scorer, but maybe he'll be first Newcastle Knights try scorer, guys. Now second tackle to Croker. Croker now. Croker. Dearden's try saving tackle was insane. I thought Cobo was gone for sure a try. Mate, I think a lot of people thought so, William Hunt. If you didn't think so, mate, what game are you watching? It just felt like it was written, right, for him to get it. It was written in the book, but Tom Dearden said, no, 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 here's the eraser and rubbed out the error. Gamble. Back. Now, over the half bit, Bunty Afoa holding him. 25. Crossland now. Back. Over. And now Bradman Best collects and gets held down here. Bradman Best, ladies and gentlemen. And oh no! Okay, Legend, that's going to be the New Zealand Warriors ball there. Best frustrated at himself with that play there. Oh, you're kidding me. What type of dough, bread dough? Mate, I love that we've got pretty much just the discussion about fishing in the chat and how to lure fish. That's just so funny to me. That just in the chat with discussing the fishy wishies and stuff. The New Zealand Warriors here. The Waz, Wade Egan, finds his way over to the left here with Adam Pompey. Adam Pompey, legends love me some Pompey. Egan back, Harris, Tohu Harris, also what to sweet it up with. Jack asking for the advice, bro. Wade Egan back over, gets it to SJ, SJ with the clearance, uh, and now it ends up with Kalen Pogger. Now the number one, Kalen Pogger. Kalen Pogger, come on, Pogger, what can you do? Kalen Pogger held down now. Now Jack Pogger, over to Thomas Jenkins. Thomas Jenkins, Thomas Jenkins down the middle. Come on, can he charge forward here? The Warriors managing to force him back here. Made his game 104 so far for Caleb Ponga, which is above the next two. Adam Panua Blake and Roger Tuvasa Shek with 103. 100 to Nari Tuala and Mitch Barnett slightly less. But still, for a forward, Mitch Barnett's doing it, guys. Um, Hack Jack, yeah, mate. Yeah, bros. It is using their own food chain and is really smart. It's really intelligent, bro, Aussie of you. Now the Newcastle Knights get themselves to the 40. Adam Elliott, short, Jelliot Elliott. Oh, what a pass. Thomas Jenkins, if only he managed to link up well with that. That would have been something else for the Legends. That would have been something truly special to be held to. Now the Newcastle Knights with the high clearance and kicks. And RTS manages it. Roger Tuvasa Shek here. Pass one, pass two, pass three. Oh, Roger Tuvasa Shek, legends. The effort there from him in the fullback position. I love to see it. Now, Marcelo Montoya 
Montoya, a bursting through as if he's a prop or a second row forward, the number five. Now Dallin will change the last year. Back over. And now it ends up with Rocco Berry. Rocco Berry to DWZ. The referee makes the call, though. And Rocco Berry is furious with such a thing. It's going to be the Newcastle Knights ball, despite how incredible of a run that would have been. Here comes the step of God, RTS, mate. Here comes the step of God. RTS. Roger Tumas has check. You can't beat him when he's on a roll. Mate, imagine the 10 meter line getting past three players like that. My sister won a fishing contest with her. What's it? They get too big. Big hers was over a kilo. Jeez, mate. Over a kilo? Far out. Ice Jay frustrated there, but of course the pass wasn't great. And now we've got a feed for the Knights right on the halfway line. They've only got a game 40 meters in about six tackles. So here they go. Newcastle Knights, guys. Good push there and shove from them. Phoenix Crossland over to the right here. Gamble back now. Gets it to Mr. Jack Cogger. Jack Cogger, guys. The man finally managing to get his position in the coffin. Ben Crossland to the left. Adam Jelliot. Jelliot dummies. Adam Jelliot here. And the Warriors hold him back. Don't forget, guys. First day footy. Storm and Broncos. I'm still debating whether I will stream next week being in Canberra Legends. But uh, hopefully I will. All right? Hopefully I will be streaming Legends. Hopefully. We can, um, it's likely, but it's like, there's a chance that I do a lot of more family time. So we probably won't be as many streams, but certainly will stream, surely, at points next week. Oh, Gamble with the low kick, Tyson Brazil! And after a brilliant tackle earlier in the game, he puts the Knights back into it. Tyson Brazil doing the work for him. Tyson Brazil scores, and the Knights, the visiting side, score on the international territory. The Warriors, guys, the step of God, not enough for him. Tyson Gamble, what a kick, and what a receive from Tyson Brazil. It was Tyson to Tyson Legends, the battle of the Tysons. You could not stop them. Nobody was was, was going to be in the way of that. Try! Nobody could handle it. Nobody could put up a fight. Nobody could defend. It was brilliant. This is a great game, mate. Absolutely it is. Great stuff, ladies and gentlemen, here. Tyson Brazil with the try, try time. I'm loving it. I'm loving it. I don't know about you legends, but I'm loving it. Loving it. Loving it. I'm loving it. Who? Mate, brilliant game so far, William Hunt, man. I know I responded to your comment before, but I'm, like, just saying it has been a great game so far. Tyson to Tyson, lol, nice, mate. It is. It's Tyson to Tyson. Tyson Frizzell to Gamble, bro. Tyson, Tyson. Now Kalen's going to score. That doesn't work. Get Tyson on it. Clearly, Tyson's who can score for them, so put Tyson on it. Tyson or Tyson. You can't go wrong with either, but go with Tyson. <laughs> Go on, Legends. Warriors now. The Newcastle Knights, if they get this, are only behind by six. And there they go! Down the middle! And now we only have a one converted try margin. Excited the Knights fans become. Warriors fans, a little less so excited. <laughs> a little more nervous. A little more, more stressed in this one, guys. Up to 20% of hot deal here. Super Easter sale legends. $1 upsize deal. Uh, $1 upsize deal. Uh, Alright legends. Halfway. We're going to kick off this once again here. Three minutes to go. In the first half. Do we have any more tries coming our way? Or is that the end? Tyson versus Jake Paul. Who you go for Tyson too? Mate, absolutely I'd go for Tyson. I can't stand Jake Paul. But that's just my opinion. You know. I guess people can have their opinions. But I can't stand Jakey bro. I'd go Tyson all the way. If I was going between the two of them man. Um, I'm not a I'm not a Jakey boy kind of guy. I've never really watched him bro. So come on. So come on Tyson bro. Tyson all the way legends. Now, down over here, Jackson Ford holds back with Wade Egan. Wade Egan now. They're reading the defense well here. 
Ah, oh, Maratta near Corey on the field with the good defense. Chanel Harris to beat. I scored a try earlier. Adam Jelliot, the Jelliotin stops. Uh, well, my pop enjoyed fishing. I don't uh, fish much, Legend, but um, I don't mind it. I don't mind fishing. I just don't really do it much. And oh, the Warriors are forced into an error here. They kick it. The Knights and the Wires drop it. Now, the defense on the right is gone. The right defense on the right is gone. Here comes Dylan Lucas. And oh no, he didn't pass it. Didn't pass it. Now, Thomas Jenkins. Back to Gamble. Back over. Can we get a Tyson to Tyson again? It's only the Tyson sessions. Then over. Croker. Skips out on Pogger. Goes to Bradman Best. The simply the best man. Stopped. Sean Johnson and the Warriors defensively desperate here to not blow their 12 0 lead. Tyson Gamble here. Now over Newcastle Knights. Tyson bit Hollywood's ear off. Jake Paul probably not. Mate, he won't do well, will he? Gamble. Ponga. Back. And now no to Allah! Two tackles left in this set, guys. Back over, Bradman Best, Caleb Pogger. Caleb Pogger with the kick. And Frizzell for a double! No! Montoya saves the day for the Warriors. The defensive hero. Get this man a cape and a suit. The man's bigger than Superman and Batman combined. The MCU could not handle the heroics of Marcelo Montoya in that position. Faith 5, there you have it. Marcelo Montoya Legends. Now SJ. Kicking the ball to clear it in the goal line dropout. Ends up over with the man Matt Croker. Matt Croker stops now. Can't wait to see it for an uppercut combo to Jake. Can't wait, William Hunt, bro. Can't wait. Koga. Heverington. Heverington now, mate, he, God, look at, not Heverington, no, he's looking for the pass here, and he gets it to Crossland, and they're going to say he's held instead, oh, okay, now, second tackle, Legend, they've got 10 seconds left, though, so, I actually think that they'll, uh, oh, no, four, three, two, one, one more play of the ball, Legends, one more play, Bradman Best here, offloads back to Caleb Pogger, Caleb Pogger now, Caleb Pogger kicks it. He kicks it. He kicks it. Oh, the chasers. The chasers, but no one's there. Where was Thomas Jenkins? Where was Thomas Jenkins? That's where Jenkins could have gotten it. That's where Jenkins could have gotten it. Ridiculous, legends. Absolutely ridiculous, guys. And at halftime, the score is Warriors 12. The Newcastle Knights 6. Only 6 points the difference. Wade Egan, the difference maker. New Obviously, Newcastle Knights performing possibly one of their better games of the year. In fact, it might be their best game in general of the season. Really good job from them. Mate, congratulations so far, though, to the Warriors for managing to hold on here. I'm getting a real Dragons manly vibe in terms of a possible upset here in how the game's gone, Legends. And yep, it is time for the moment you guys always seem to wait for. The TJC Sports Halftime Show. With your host, TJC Sports Legend. Let's update that. Never lose it. Alright, let's see. Yep, there we go. There it is. Jake will be lucky if he limbs. Alright, alright, alright. Thank you guys. Thank you. Hi, Dean Love Stuff. Welcome to the chat, Legends. Thank you all for joining, guys, on this wonderful stream. Make sure you like and subscribe as always if you enjoy and enjoy this segment where, of course, you guys can always start some conversations going and all that. And we can just honestly discuss, have a bit of a chill time at halftime, you know? A little bit of a chat up. That's exactly what we like to do around this time, Legends. Just have a fun time all round. So, make sure you get to the chat. Feel free to ask questions. Feel free to share your thoughts on the game so far. All that good stuff, Legends, before, obviously, the second half will come back to us and kick off again. 
And right to the me and says, I have one question. Why are Manly playing bad now? They're playing bad now, mate, because that's just how rugby league works, bro, unfortunately. Okay, no matter how you feel, uh, man, the Manly Warringah Seagulls, I said this, they started well. They started well. But form, Legends, is a real thing, okay? It is a real thing. The Dragons, the Dragons did great against Manly. The dra the Dragons guys were un- I, di I couldn't even believe what I was watching. But, of course, you know, I did think that the Dragons would win. But I did think the Dragons could win. But, like, by that much, it was just, like, what was I watching at that point, Legends? What was I uh, watching? What was I uh, viewing? Crazy stuff, guys, honestly. Ridiculous, even. I... I think in general, bro, what it is is that, you know, the GOAT Luke Brooks had an off game, bro. They'll come back. They'll come back, mate. The GOAT Luke Brooks was just having an off game, mate. You can't ever keep the Luke Brooks quiet for too long. Luke Brooks legends. He'll bounce back. I still can't believe we're halfway through the second last stream of the round, guys. You know, the streams, it's always like, oh, a long week of stream before I do them. But then they go by so quick. It's kind of funny. You know, but I can't complain. Live streams have been great for the channel, and I really do enjoy doing them for the most part. They're a fun time overall, but um, yeah, it does, it definitely takes a bit out of you, and I'm probably going to be, okay, like, if I were to look at, like, let's just say there was good internet at the hotel, right, Legends? I would probably do the Thursday stream, I'd probably do the Thursday stream. Um, the uh, Friday, ooh, Friday I might do the games, but um, see, I Saturday, I couldn't do all three games, Legends. I might do, like, Buddy's Warriors take... I might do Buddy's Warriors. Like, I could do one of the early ones, but I could. I can't see myself being able to do one or two streams a day, Legends. So, um, I reckon expect um, about three streams about next round, I'd say. Okay, plus you've got the vlog coming out. And on the day it comes out, uh, which will be the Tuesday, that'll be my last day before... Like, that'll be a day purely just to rest for me to to upload the vlog, because on the Wednesday, I will be, you know, traveling to Canberra for the week and all that. I'm getting, I'm getting to that. How is your Easter? Oh, my Easter's going great, Dean Love stuff. I hope your Easter's going okay, man. You got gelato? Sweet, bro. Hope you enjoy it. Enjoy, mate. Dean Love stuff, mate. Obviously, I know that you don't celebrate Easter now. You celebrate it in, uh, uh, May, right? You celebrate it in May. So, um, you know, feel free to let me know when it's your Easter, and I'll say happy Easter to you, but for now, me and the Easter Bunny here. Easter Bunny, what are we going to say to him? Happy Easter. Happy Easter, legend, mate. From me and the Mr. Easter Bunny here, legends. Da 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 da. Enjoying ourselves. Hop on out of here now, though, Mr. Easter Bunny. I know you're a busy guy. You've got a lot of chocolate and stuff to deliver, man. My Easter is in May. Exactly. Yeah, some of you have your Easter in May. So enjoy your Easter in May, legend. Yeah, your Easter is in May. Enjoy your Easter in May, guys, the ones that have it there. The ones that have Easter today, though, Legends, happy Easter. Is Will and Stephanie in the chat, TJC? No, Viking Axe, um, no. In fact, Steph, I don't know. I don't think Steph will be in the chat for a while, Legend. Haven't seen Steph in ages. Usually it's Mel and Will if there's ones in the chat, Legend. Will you'll see around quite a bit, though, still. The Warriors fans, legends, you got to give it to them how cool it is the way they show up, guys. Look at that. Like, the crowd. I know that the crowd's just better because of how they're doing, but, like, it's still good to see, you know. The New Zealand Warriors are a team where I love seeing a, you know, show up from them. They're the kind of side where I just, I want them to do well for themselves, you know. They're just that kind of, yeah. That's how I kind of, how I feel. So, yeah, Legend, expect about three or four streams next uh, week. Uh, for now, though, who am I expecting to win? For me, right now, the Newcastle Knights, they they started pretty poor for their first 20 minutes. For their first 20 minutes, I feel like they gave Warriors way too much of the ball. It's it's not until that second bit of the first half where the Newcastle Knights really picked themselves up and got back into the rhythm of things. Webster now having a talk with SJ about how he can play. Mate, Webster, what a coach, mate. He knows what to do for his team. And yet, we had Mr. Ivan Cleary being like, Seraldo's the man to look out for. Seraldo, legend. No, 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 no. 
Enjoy your day tomorrow, Heels fans. Go Tigers. <laughs> may the best team win, Dean. I know you go for buddies, but may the best team win because you're going for Tigers in that game, Legend. May the best team win. Pat Garrigan, next Queensland captain, Forts TJC. I, I rate it. I rate Patrick Carrigan as the next Queensland captain. He's really got that, um, what's the word, kind of. He's really got that motivation, in my opinion. He's got that kind of bark about him, the way he orders around while doing so much for the team. You can tell that he really wants to be there, that he really wants to, he wants to represent the greatest state Queensland legends. And for me, he's the ideal pick. You know, bring him as the next captain. I also, no, but I think there's a few changes with Queensland, you know, like, I want to see a rotation between him and Jermaine. I want him to be the captain, but I want Jermaine to come into the side on the interchange legends. Jermaine hot good guys also. He'll be an amazing addition for Queensland when he finally gets a shot there. Trust me. The boy will be ready for it. More than ready. He'll be super ready for it. Legends. As ready as he'll ever be. As ready as he'll ever, ever, ever get a shot to be. Legends. Nero's Easter is in the 5th of May. Yeah, for you. For you, May. I tipped tonight, so hopefully they move up a few gears in the second half and really bring it. Hopefully, Legend. Hopefully they go up another gear, but hopefully everyone goes up another gear. Come on, Legends. Go up another gear. Where's your gears, guys? You gotta show me your gears. You gotta show me them. Come on, guys. Come on, guys. Do it for the money. Do it for the bunny boys and girls. Get it up. Get it up. Pump it up. Got to pump it up. 50 votes so far on the poll, Legends. The Warriors up the Waz is 64%. You guys reckon the Warriors are going to win for the most part, and I'm with you on that. Oh, uh, look at the mascots on the field. <laughs> the mascot race here, Legends. Look at that. That's funny. That's funny. The giraffe wins. Is it a giraffe? Or what is he? What is he? The potato's the slowest one of them all, of course. The lazy potato. Uh, for twenty-four percent, if you have got knights, so you're a very small minority if you reckon that the knights win, uh, legends. But you know, it's it's tight things right now, so maybe it'll happen. Draw at four percent, none. The rest slash bunker wins is at um, the, the the wonderful eight percent. Yummy gelato. Breaking news, AJ to miss six weeks. TJC, AJ from Rabbits. Oh, Alex Johnston's out for six weeks. I thought you meant AJ Brimson for a second. I was going to be like, oh, God, it's not getting better for time. It's, but, um, yeah, and that's actually a little bit of a relief, to be honest. But, ah, oh, that's a loss for the Bunnies, man. They're going to miss him. They're going to miss him. There's a reason that he's such a high scorer for them. He's a good player, Legends. You know, no matter what people want to call him when they go, he's a tapping guy. He's a tapping guy. He's a tapping merchant. He's a good player, and they're going to miss him. Is this some costume derby? I don't know, man, but I loved it. I loved to watch it. Mate, the potato slow, bro. It was funny to watch, honestly, <laughs> looking at it on the TV, bro. Go mascots. No idea who was who, bro. They just randomly were there, but good on them, I say. Alex Johnson, though, will be a massive out. Who do they have filling in for him? Um, there is my question. Have they updated the NRL app or explained exactly who's filling in for Alex uh, Alex Johnston, man? Have they kind of, like, have they given us an idea who's going to fill in for him the next game? The team list obviously aren't out yet. I'm an idiot. But, um, yeah. Who do we think's going to fill in? Is it going to be, like, is Isaac Thompson a shot? I don't know, Legends. I, I'm trying to think exactly. Tad Mild will we'll take a spot. There is, and Tyro Monroe. Will Monroe be back? Monroe is a is another key factor in this, okay? Is it like Joffrey Berrifer's wedding night midget? Do I play the box material? I don't know, Legend. I don't know, Aussie Bloke Craig. Good luck for Eels. Appreciate it, Dean. Love stuff, mate. I'm going to need a bit of luck. <laughs> Should be a good vlog, though, and I'm excited for it. Even though, you know, we still got to get on with this stream and the next stream after Legends here. Let's go. What do you think, Humpty Dumpty? He thinks we're going to get the job done. He thinks we're going to have a fun time, guys. He thinks we're going to have a fun, fun time. Um, honestly, it's just... It's crazy, you know, it's always special these kind of days, um, you know, Easter, it's just a day where that means a lot to so many, 
it's a day that means a lot to so many where we come together, you know, we, whether you believe or not, just, you know, having the faith, believing, um, what it represents is just, yeah, it's something else, man. Uh, currently, guys, honestly, I feel like the Knights should be a little closer on the pole, looking at it, besides, you know, yes, the Warriors, they deservingly are in the front, in the pole, but, like, I feel like I expected a little more from the Dewey fans in support. What is Easter Bunny up to? I don't know, man. I don't know, man. I don't know what the Easter Bunny is up to, man. Have you seen the Easter Bunny? I can't find the Easter Bunny anywhere, Legends. I can't find the Easter Bunny anywhere. Have you seen him? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I thought I saw him for a sec. Anyways, Legends. Anyways, you seen him? <laughs> He's there he is. There's the buddy. He popped up, Legends. Ta-da. He's doing all right. He's ready for a big, continuous match. All right, the second half is going to happen soon, and then there's the next game. Look at him. That is the face of excitement. That is the face of excitement, Legends, there in the stream. Look at him. He's ready. He was ready. He's now going to just go back to laying the chalky eggs into the basket, Legends. Goodbye. He just had to find his way back, dudes. He was a little busy. He got a little lost, but he's going back to the eggs now to sort them out. And honestly, I, I just want the second half. It looks like the players are ready for the second half to happen extremely soon. The players are running out onto the field, Legends. So it's time to end the halftime show for here, guys. It is time to change it to second half because let halftime show should be over in just a moment. Okay, Legends, second half, second half soon. Second half very, very soon. I'll just change it to say second half soon, guys. All right. The TJC half time show will be put to the end here. Up the Waz. Who came up with Up the Waz? How, who was the one saying Up the Waz, guys? All right. The New Zealand Warriors, the Newcastle Knights. A six-point difference underway. We have it here, Legends. Second half of Rugby League. Super Sunday! Let's go! Second half, William Hunt. Night 13 plus still says Viking Axe. Mate, Viking Axe, I still call you a bold predictor, but, mate, you've always been a bit of a bold predictor. The fact that you're not going with the referee to win really tells me how much you have grown, bro, because usually you go with the ref to win. I'm in shock that you're tipping an actual team. Like, my goodness, Viking Axe. That is what the actual heck. Adam Elliott now. Adam Jellian. Adam Jellian on the 40 on the 40 meter fourth tackle here. 4 4 4. Back to Tyson Frizzell. Remember Tyson to Tyson. It's the only try so far for the Newcastle Knights in this game here. Now Crossland back. And now Jack Cogger. Jack Cogger back. And now RTS. Roger Tuvasa Sheck there. Roger Tuvasa Sheck Sheck mate. Roger Tuvasa catch. We should be calling him with a catch like that. Marcelo Montoya then. Marcelo Montoya trying to barge through the line, but they're like a wall there keeping him back. Dallas with Chandy's Alesniak now. I tipped Warriors. I tipped Warriors too, man. So um, we'll see. I mean, I personally just thought the Warriors should win well, but no, the Newcastle Knights are proven time and time again why tipping is just the absolute worst in rugby league, guys. Absolute worst to be able to do. Bunty Afoa now. Bunty Afoa. Bunty Afoa with the foot push through here. Bunty Afoa held. Wayne Egan now on the fifth tackle. SJ's just going to have to clear it. We saw Webster talking to him at halftime about his kicking. Maybe he wasn't too impressed with everything done in the first half. But the second half, he's going to change his ways and be even better than he was then, guys. The improvement is going to be there. The unbelievable, exceptional ability he's got in the tip of his toes, guys. Sean Johnson, guys. Remember, former Cronulla Sharky, the Sharkies play next, guys. The Sharks, they won't be feeling too bad getting Nico Hines while the Warriors got Mr. Sean Johnson. But, um, yeah, will both those halfbacks be getting a win today? Right now, the answer could be yes. With the, the next game yet to be played, Canberra Raiders and the Sharks. Honestly, I don't know whether I would rather play a team like the Raiders coming off a win or a loss, guys. I don't know the kind of side they are. I'm going to wait and see how they play versus this next team, because losing two in a row for Raiders is going to be, ugh. 
Anyways, Newcastle Knights, they clear it. And down the with 10 years or less, yeah, it collects. DWZ now. DWZ down the middle. Mate, awesome, Dean. Love that you love it, bro. Appreciate it, legend. Now, RTS. Roger to Avasa Shek here. And the Newcastle Knights, he's clearly a player they came to read here. Roger to Avasa Shek. RTS, guys. The Newcastle Knights, they always seem to have two or three players on him. So he's someone that, where I think they were waiting for him to do stuff. They probably made a lot of their game plan around chasing him and making sure that he doesn't do anything. But it meant that they've given more space to other players too, which has kind of gone against them in the end when it comes to their defense in this game. SJ. Back. RTS. Roger Tulvastashek finds the offload to Sean Johnson. Sean Johnson now. SJ. One, two, three, four. Tackle now. He will run over more. Egan. Egan goes vegan with a try like that. And now it ends up with Montoya. Montoya! What a catch! Marcelo Montoya! And now they've got it! Marcelo Montoya! The Wars fans go wild! Montoya puts on the Montoya. He does it 16 to 6. The Wars extend their lead up the Wars Roars New Zealand! Unbelievable! Chanel Harris Demeter doing what Sean Johnson wouldn't. Montoya Legends making the difference for the Warriors. And now we have a a a freaking 16 six lead for the Warriors in this one. Do, 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 do. Who are the eels facing on round five? Canberra Raiders. That's why I'm traveling to Canberra for, for a vlog for Para. <laughs> yes. 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 That might be, that might be okay. You did lose. Yep. Okay. Yeah, but yeah, legend, I'm going to Canberra to watch Para Raiders. That's the Raiders Para, mate. That's what I'm doing. The vlog, bro. That's what that, that's why I'm going there for a week. I'm not just going a week there for fun. It's cold. All right, guys. 16 to 6, a 10 point lead for the Warriors. The Newcastle Knights, they haven't been too bad compared to previous games, but they just haven't been able to find that win. My concern with their win against, look, the Storm, it's a great win, but, uh, you know, Storm didn't have either of their halves. Now, a lot of positions like forward, I would go, oh, you know, whatever. But. The halves, in in today's game in Rugby League, the halves are the make or break, man. They've always been an important position, but even, especially now, the difference they make. If Pampers didn't have Cleary or Luai, they wouldn't be quite the same. They would still be great, but they wouldn't be quite the same because you need those halves to unlock the rest of the team, Legends. You need decent halves. That's my point. You know, and unless you have some good juniors, which... Um, you know, I know the Storm do, but still, only a two-point win for the Knights really gave me the feeling Warriors were going to win this one. And so far, I've been proven right. But of course, you know, it's not impossible for a comeback in this one. Not impossible, but, uh, you know, wouldn't exactly call it the uh, most likely ever. Not going to happen. My they are not going to happen, bro. Changing my tip back to the ref. You're changing your tip back to the ref after this, bro. Oh, I... I feel like it, with the, how the Knights started, it was a little silly to ever go with Newcastle Knights 13 plus in New Zealand, bro. But, okay, you want to tip the ref now, legend. <laughs> tip the fucking X, mate. Now, the Warriors, Montoya, held on the 40. Toyu Harris now. Harris, the captain, hoping to spark a little bit of leadership. Knights forwards and the Haas and keep helping KP out. They're not doing it, Mike and Axe. They're not helping him. Well, Tyson Frizzell's doing a job. Honestly, both the Tysons have done good, and, and um, I can't say Pogas had a bad game, but, like, something about the team, I, yeah, I just don't think they're helping out enough, the rest of the side. Also, Thomas Jenkins guy, he's, he's not, he's not it. Thomas Jenkins, guys, has not been it today, and I can't say I've watched every game of the Knights this season, but from the ones I've seen, he has not impressed me much on the uh, wing for them, and it's just a severe drop-off from Dominic Young, guys, who, for all the Roosters, is doing, you know, wonders, okay? <laughs> He's having a fun time for them. 
I think Panthers would do would not win much if David Cleary was on a different team. If David Cleary was on a different team, I don't think they would finish the end, bro. You're right. They wouldn't do be as dominant as they are, but you know, I also think Luai helps a little. I don't think Luai's nearly as good as Cleary, but he helps a little. Better NRL is the best. Better than all the rest. I'm off to just see all good Viking acts, bro. I'll need luck versus the Tigers. Still one more stream after this, Legends. We're versus the Warriors. Oh, no. Yeah, that's going to be tough for you, uh, Dean Love stuff, mate. Um, the Warriors are not going to be an easy team to beat. <laughs> if I'm going to be straight up with you, Legend, they're going to be a tough one. You're going to be in for a game there for your side. You're going to be in for a bit of a fight, Legend. Um, Dean Love stuff. So back your team and hope they can get it. Cheer for them loud and proud. Give them all the passion you can. Show them that you're there for them so that they can hopefully get the job done. Montoya, Harris, back over here, Pompey. The Newcastle Knights holding their line together in the defence here. Doing the job, but not, clearly not enough with the score being 18-6, to 6, right? Then back over, Warriors, SJ, Sean Johnson, forcing it. Oh, come on, Roger Tuvasa, Sheck with the sprint speed. Roger Tuvasa, Sheck, you won last year, mate. You did it last year, bruh. You did it last year. I'm assuming you won your game against Warriors last year, which is great, man. Hopefully you can get the win again this one. Tommy Harris. Wade Egan. And now Sean Johnson. Sean Johnson. Sean Johnson. Oh, what a high kick that was. And Tuala has to absolutely leap into the air to collect that one, guys. Almost spilt the lollies, but he managed to get it. Jack Conger now stealing the lollies from him so he can serve it over to a customer known as... Uh, Bradman Best, simply the best. Adam Elliott, the Jelliot, forcing, forcing forward here. Next week, the Knights play the Dragons, 7.30pm. Honestly, the Dragons, guys, I would give the Dragons the the uh, the form, but also Dragons are inconsistent, it feels, from what I've watched. So maybe the Knights, this is the moment for the Knights to win, though. I think the Knights should, the Dragons is the kind of team the Knights will, would beat, right? Surely. I'll have to think it a little more. I mean, I honestly, I feel like the Dragons could win that one. It's it's really back and forth for Reds. It's really back and forward. Yeah, Koga was at Penrith Legend. He won a premiership uh, with the men, um, you know, but he's also been at a few clubs, uh, Legends, uh, before, you know, being at the Penrith Panthers. He even had a stint in England, mate. J Jackson Ford now. Mitch Barnett, bro, look at the force there from him. The sheer force to push himself. You got, you got to think about it, guys. They're getting hit so hard to to gain like ten meters. The players have to really rush into it. Roger Tubasa check now. Roger Tubasa check. RTS and RTS stopped on the twenty. Now Sean Johnson kicks low here. All the chases in sight. Caleb Pong is just going to do his job as a fullback and flop on the ground there. Knights need to make a comeback. They need to make a comeback, and they need to make a comeback soon, bro. Not just make one. It's uh, about 30, 60, 70, yeah, about 30 minutes left in it. Since last stoppage time, there has been five minutes, guys. Five straight minutes of back and forth. No stopping, guys. They've got to be tired. Got to be feeling those legs with that, guys. Bradman Best. Bradman Best now. The Warriors holding him back and out here. For Crossland then, over to the right where Heverington is in support. Heverington now. Heverington trying to use his sp his um, speed and his little size there. Adam Elliott now. The former Canberra Raider here. We've got a former Raider and a former Sharky on opposite teams. If this is a sign of the next game, then that means the Raiders will lose to the Sharkies. You know, Sean Johnson, the former Sharky with the victory um, so far. And um, the former Raider, Adam Elliott, with the loss here so far. Now back, Adam Pompey. Adam Pompey, then. I'm pretty sure they would have played each other on both sides, actually, as well. Uh, the two different kind of games versus each other. DWZ now. Dallin with 10 years of Lesniak. Come on. Dallin with 10 years of Lesniak. DWZ. We all know when DWZ plays right, he can do something. I, I actually think Montoya's been the better winger so far to start things off. Um, Dallin with 10 years of Lesniak needs to up it a little for me, um, from what I've um, spotted. From him. Now back over to Tom Harris. Oh, Kurt Catewell! Kurt Catewell's running! Kurt Catewell! 
Oh no! Oh, here he goes! And oh, he ruins it all with a knock on! Oh, getting too excited there, he loses his marbles! He got too excited, Legends. Kurt Catewell, the former Bronco and Panther. Ah, oh, he had the chances, my friend Charlie, who goes for Paris, going to that game. Awesome day, love stuff. Hopefully, he has a fun time there. Man, I hope he has a brilliant time. My best friend Charlie, who is a fan of Paris, he was going to the South and Warriors game. Awesome. I hope he has a fun time. You know, you know, um, it's always a good one. Beware, though. Warriors fans are very passionate for their team. So if you don't like a way to fans cheering, you won't like us. Right. Get me something? Get me something? Yeah. <laughs> Thomas Jenkins. Thank you. I'm streaming. <laughs> Crossland. Now to Frizzell. Tyson Frizzell now. Tyson Frizzell, guys, only try scorer today for the Newcastle Knights. Come on, Knights. Knights, where's your pick-up game, guys? Pick it up. Pick it up. Pick, pick, pick it up. Pick it up. Pick it up. Oh, pick it up. Pick it up. Pick it up. Pick it up. Oh, well, then he should subscribe, Dean Love Stuff. He should subscribe, bro. Should sub to the channel. Koga. Now clearing the ball. And it ends up with... Oh, my God. Thomas Jenkins, mate. Jenkins, mate. Chase it, bro. I don't like hate him, but chase it, bro. Chase it, bro, mate. Do more, man. I need a little bit more of this one, okay? I need a little bit more being given to me. Dallas will tell you the lesbian act here. Zalezi, 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 Zalezi held. Now Jazz Tavaga, Jazz Tavaga get taking a tackle as smooth as Jay is there, as smooth as the day it was born. Appreciate it, Dean. Love stuff, mate. Kurt Catewell says, uh, did a pick and is on my Broncos calendar for this month as a Bronco. And here he is playing for a non Aussie team, traitor. <laughs> I know, man. I know, he jumped off the Bronx and went to the Wise man. Oh, Kurt Kate, well, almost there, but he messes it up again. He is a trainer, bro, jumping to the Warriors. Honestly, to be fair, if I was a player, I'd probably, you know, I wouldn't fight against playing for Warriors for a year or something, even though I probably would never get signed because of the fact that, um, you know, I've got a lot of family up there, but... Um, you know, I couldn't commit to it. Jeez, I'm Aussie, bro. I'm Aussie through and through. The way I talk, mate. G'day, legends. You know, literally, my intro is g'day, legends. Like, what could I really do with Waz, you know? Like, if I was a Waz man, I couldn't say g'day, legends. What would I be able to say? Like, what what would I say if I was um, New Zealand guys? That I couldn't say g'day. Croker now. I know you're a subscriber, Dean, and I appreciate it, mate. Honestly, we're doing really good, guys. We're, um, you know, we're over halfway to that uh, 4K goal by the end of the thing. Uh, 4,000 subscribers. That's the lowest we want to get at the end of this season. And we're going well with it. Yeah, man, I'm seeing the Parliament House. I'm going to quite a few places, all right? In fact, we might include an odd few little bits of the holiday on the vlog legend just as little scenery pieces for the opening guys so get ready for that get ready warriors jackson board down the wing jackson board jackson board going jackson board now chase down chanel harris tavita now harris tavita over to the right here montoya scored a try today Honestly, I'm not going to lie, the Easter Bunny here, he's looking rather tasty with the way I'm feeling during this stream. He's looking rather tasty. Uh, he looks a little scared, though, to hear that, Legends. He looks a little bit terrified of me saying that. Maybe I'll just go for Humpty instead of you, Easter Bunny. But, uh, mate, you're looking really tempting right now, mate. Okay, Legends, the New Zealand Warriors push this over to the third. You like Warriors? Absolutely, I like Warriors, mate. I'm going to Para Warriors this year in New Zealand, Legends. This is how much I care about making vlogs for you. I am going to New Zealand this year. The only games that will elude me are the ones in Queensland, and they will not elude me next year. Next year, I will have saved up, and I will go to every Parramatta Eels game, Legends. That's right, every Parramatta Eels game next year. I'm going to make a vow 
that I will not miss more than, like, one game next year at the max. Okay, Legends? I'm making that vow. For the Parramatta Eels, I will go all the way. At the Good Friday game, I made two new friends. I'm glad to hear it, Dean Love stuff, mate. you got to make friends, Legends, at your age, man. Friends. But remember, you know, um, only the best friendships last your entire life. Okay, almost an hour in here into this one, and then that'll leave 20 minutes to go in the game. On the fifth tackle here, we're going to restart. The fifth tackle, the Warriors will just get the chance to maybe kick it very high for a chase. But I think the Knights will read it too well, and it will just simply be theirs. Unless they can force them in for a goal line dropout! A goal line dropout is here! And at the Easter Warriors fans! You're going to be getting the ball once again! See a building where Masters us, control us lying and stealing our money. Uh, what's it? Why would you want to see a building? Honestly, mate, I don't get too into that. I also just want to see the... Um, I just also want it because it's good family time legends, mate. It's good family time. That's why I want to go see it. Honestly, I don't get too much into the... There was a time when I was younger where I was really into my politics. In fact, it was really funny, you know, my grandpa talking to my mother, like, going, how come he can talk about politics, but he can't hold a spoon at the age... He can't really hold a spoon at the age of two and a half legends. At two and a half, I was talking politics, but I wasn't... Um, I wasn't able to hold a spoon. That's autism for you guys. That's classic autism. <laughs> <laughs> William Hunt says constant pressure on the Wars in the second half. Mate, now they're putting the pressure on the Knights, but you're right, tons of pressure coming to them. Definitely not a simple time, eh? Wade Egan now, back to Sean Johnson, gets it to Chanel Harris Devita for the line. And Chanel Harris Devita held down here. Now the Newcastle Knights, Tyson Gamble with the chance. Purely just family time, bro. That's the only reason. You know, my fa my family's really excited to get the chance to hang out with me because ever since I did the channel, I haven't had much time to hang out with them outside of the, like, one day or two days that I don't stream, depending. You know, we get the break when the, street, when the season's not on, but it's really, you know, it's very limited time compared to once, when it once was, guys. The, during COVID, there were years where um, we'd have the entire day just us, you know, so, yeah. You didn't go to every para game last year. Well, because I couldn't afford it, Dean Love stuff, mate. I couldn't afford it. But um, every year we're aiming to go into more and more games, Legends, because it's not easy to go to every game, bro. It's not easy to go to every game, but I wouldn't expect everyone to go to it. There's probably people just as big fans of me who will never go to every game or might not even go to a game because it's tough, Legends, okay, sometimes. It depends where you live. It depends on how much you're going to have to pay to get there, conveniency, and all that good stuff, all right? Yeah, I didn't go to all the games, but I went to majority last year, Legend, I went to about 18 or something, it was a, it was a good amount of Eels games, mate, and uh, just like that, this year I'm going to go to even more and still be in the majority of Eels games as well. Our first game that we will not be streaming is the Dolphins and Para Darwin game. Now the New Zealand Warriors, they kick it and they chase it, but it just bounces out of play there, nothing special with that one, guys, nothing special whatsoever. We could have seen better than that. I really hope I see you on round 18. I know your face. Well, hope you do, mate. Hope you do. Um, Legends, hopefully you do see my face around, okay? I'll I'll be cheering, Legends, for my team. If we lose, we lose. You know, like, people got to remember that. We lose, still going to be optimistic. But you know what? We're not going to lose, so I don't need to worry, do I? I don't need to worry because we're not going to lose, Legends. Never. Never in a million years. We're bidding the Tigers, baby. Come on, Para. Come on. Come on. Come on! <sighs> Get it done. Get it started. Get the party rolling. Newcastle Knights now. Newcastle Knights looking to put on a show, and I hope you're trying to see me. Well, mate, we'll see, all right? My priority is my vlogs, bro, but I'll, I'll probably post where I'm sitting and stuff when I go to more away games, Legends. Jack Cogger now. If you really want to keep a firm up to date on where I am, mate, you know, somebody could always follow me on Insta because Instagram is where I really 
put up where like I'm sitting and like a little bit of height outside of the actual content itself, like if you want the bonus stuff. Small TikTok, but like I don't really do TikTok, you know. Like it's not because I can't do TikTok, it's more so just because, you know, it doesn't really interest me like YouTube or anything else. Now Roger Tuvasa Shek takes the hit. I'm actually really curious. How has Roger Tuvasa Shek done for me? Because it would only be base stats and offloads right now for him as my captain. But I still think surprisingly he would have done better than RTS Legends in this um, in this game. I think he would have done better than Roger Tuvasa Shek as my captain, guys. Okay, Dean loves stuff. See you then, bro. It's very hard. Very hard, man. Now, Thomas Jenkins, I'll see you in the next stream, Dean Love Stuff, bro. 100%, you will see me in the next stream, man. We will all be good, bro. We will all be good. We will all be happy, ducky legends. We will be all very, very, very keen to continue on this path we are going. 96 is my captain. Still okay. Not amazing, but still all right. I like it. It's better than Tommy Turbo. It's like BT now. Saifiti, Saifiti down over through the middle here. Jaden Brayley, I think, gets it off here. Passes it short, Newcastle Knights. TikTok is for teen kids who want to be famous for dumb BS and the way Charlie's going to collect all of them. Yeah, exactly, Legend. I'm not very into it. I just don't feel it with TikTok. But, you know, I can't disrespect TikTok because a lot of my content creator, NRL, a lot of the NRL creators who are bigger than me, um, you know, a lot of them, not all of them, not Blaze, but Lord Big Cow, but like there's quite a few where their big platform is TikTok, where they're famous legends, um, or, or TikTok famous. Um, you know, Hainsey's biggest platform for me is TikTok. Um, uh, Winston Neville's biggest platform is TikTok. Emilio DeSavage's biggest platform is TikTok. No, he doesn't do as much NRL anymore. Mate, legend you, by the way. Um, um, you know, Entertain House is a decent TikTok following, but he's more YouTube. Um, yeah, Zane Potter, Zane Potter, he's TikTok through and through, you know, like a lot of my creator mates are TikTok through and through, so respect to them, but like, yeah, I just can't get into it to the same way. I upload the odd result or the odd reaction, but that's about it that I can really do right now in terms of my investment over on that. Well, going home now, sadly, no fish. No, Jack didn't get any fish. No. Look, to be fair, Legend, at least you hopefully had a fun time, man. Um, we were rooting for you, but unfortunately it didn't go out that way, did it, bro? Look, Jack, you'll get the fish next time. At least you probably had a nice time clearing your mind and enjoying some rugby league, right, with fishing. Like, I couldn't think of something more relaxing, you know? Trust me, it's a lot more relaxing than live stream reacting. He's like, do you... Yeah, mate, I love my Legends. I love, mate, what I've done, you know? Like, guys, people forget. I didn't always have following that I did. I didn't always have the following I did. I had a solid year where I was getting two or three likes on everything before things worked out for me. Caleb Pogger now. Caleb Pogger with the twist and the stir and the turn and the wires holding back here. The Knights push back. Now Cogger over to the left. Six again here for them. Six again for the Dewey Knights. And back over to Gamble. Tyson Gamble through the middle. Tyson Gamble held down. Here come the knights. Here come the mighty knights. Stand aside, legends. They'll smite you where they stand. The powers in their hands. A remix of the North Sydney Bears song. Newcastle Nuts. Nah, it's like, let's go. Duh, 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 duh. Which one's Newcastle Knights, legends? I'm trying to think of the Knights theme song. Usually I can think off the top of my head what the theme songs are. Newcastle Knights is, this game is our, I think I got it, this game is our game, this town is our town, turn the heat up and listen to the crowd, I timed that poorly because the Knights knocked on, down, 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 down. oh no indeed legend, no, 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 the knock on baby, and now the Newcastle Knights will carry on here, having to defend now rather than attack. This was a chance, and with 15 minutes to go, they muck it up. Silly duffers. Silly, silly boys and girls. Could have done more than what they did, legends. Could have had a little more to it. Could have had a bit more uh, fun. Could have had a 
bit similar of times than what we got um, in this one. Legends, Legeronis, legend, legendary people watching. They blew it, didn't they? They blew it, man. They blew it. Okay, that's... I hate saying, you know, oh, teams messed up, teams did, were in shambles, but they, they mucked that up completely. Speaking of mucking it up, bad play of the ball from the Warriors. The Knights, you got to get another chance. Bad play of the ball from the Warriors. They blew it, bro. You idiot. Darn you. You blew it up. You blew it up, you legend. Okay, now, feeding in the scrum here, the new Castle Knight with the chance. Yes, the NRL is live, Maxi Kale. You can check it out on KO or Foxtel or watch the live stream reaction. Reaction, legend. The reaction. Kai Pierce Paul. Kai Pierce Paul. Now, that's actually why I started to put reaction in the title because people, like, yeah, you've got to make it clear. It's a reaction, not a, yeah. That's kind of how it goes with these kind of things. It's a niche, and people see, but a lot of people like it. Conga then. Back over. Gets it to Gamble. Tyson Gamble. Gamble with a little bit of the hug there. Kirk Kate while holding him back with Tabugger. Jazz Tabugger there. Then back. Braley. Saifiti. The Saifiti brothers almost linking up, but Jackson Ford ruins it for them. And now Jackson Ford squeezes through the line there. Ending. The hopes of anything more happening. Oh, my goodness, me, legends. My goodness, me. My goodness. My mess up, me. Jeez, Knights. I, oh, my God, yes. It's uh, the errors from the Knights. It's making me tired just watching them, guys. I'm like, I'm going, why? Why are you doing this, Newcastle? Look, comebacks ain't impossible. They score in the next uh, few minutes, it's game on. But um, I don't know if they will with the way they're playing. They just don't look like completing. It looks a little bit dull right now. Um, if you're a Newey fan, you're probably not that happy. But look, starting slow is what I expected. And I expected it to cost them the top eight. Whether um, that ends up being the case, I do not know. They could go on a great run still. They should take the Monty Python song, shall it? Shalomate and their theme song. When nights at the round table, we dance whenever we're able. We do routines and, and chorus scenes. We're footwork impeccable. We dine well here in, in Camelot. We eat ham and jam and spam a lot. Mate, they should. They should, ch mate, they should turn that totally into their song instead of the... They have a really short, this game is our game. It's town turn the hill. Listen, go nights, go home. It's not... A it's just a matter of where. Let's go, let's go. There's just not uh, much with the Knights, you know. Their song's not that deep. We could have something much funner, couldn't we, if we really wanted to. We could have had a lot fun for them. A lot more fun than what we've been handed to us on the plate. The plate we were given wasn't our favourite kind of plate, was it, Legends? I tipped the wires, but I love to see the Knights come back. A close match is always good. A close match is always great. I would have loved to come back too, bro, to be honest, in this one. It would have gotten me very excited. I I honestly would have been jumping from my seat. If the if the Knights came back, I'd be running around the room, okay? I'd probably hurt myself, but I would be running around the room, legend. All right? In fact, I'd be running with the Easter Buddy here, the Easter Buddy legends. I'd like to thank you all for this incredible work. We've grown so big that the Easter Buddy decided he wanted to join us on stream. Feel free to ask the Buddy any questions if you want for as long as he can stick around uh, Legends as long as he can stick around this poor little guy here. He's very keen. He very much likes everybody in the chat. He loves being part of the Legends. He sponsors as well. Get rid of the Izuzu did the MUX. I don't care about that. I care about um, I, I care about getting a good game of rugby league. Is what I care about. That's all I ever care about. Legends. All I care about is good rugby league. You know. Also. You know, just having the best community possible that we can in this game. Because I love this game and I want it to grow. And that's something where I went, you know what? Even I, if I were to fail as a creator, I would I would be able to at least grow the game in an initial. If it brought one person to watch Rugby League, that would have been worth it for me. And that's why I'm glad where I am. You know, where more people and more people are summoned and like it and all that stuff. And hopefully get to love their team a little more. And oh, the Warriors! 
borrowing something out of the Knights booklet, make an error. But the referee is now giving a penalty to the Wars. The Knights, you guys cannot catch a break. It's going to be two points for the Wars, I think, looking at it. Unless they're going to go into the line here. Looks like SJ's holding the ball, which makes me think that they would go for two. But no, nah, maybe the Warriors aren't going to go for two. I don't I don't know, Legends. I'm just TJC. I ain't the referee in this one. I ain't the captain of the Wars making the decisions for them right now. I ain't the big decider in it all. I'm not that. No, 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 no. I'm something else. I'm something bigger, bro. I'm something special. I'm another level, bro. Look, I tipped Warriors, but I would have liked to see the Knights put up a little bit more than what they've done here. Ah, uh, jeez. Jeez, are you ruining William Hunt? Oh. Now, Adam Penua Blake here, Legends. Yep, knew it. Taking the two guys. Sean Johnson. He has not missed a kick today, has he? He may have missed one. I, I know he hasn't missed a kick from memory. Nah, SJ has gotten every kick today. And he continues that pattern here, I think. Yes, he does. We have a 20 to 6 lead to the New Zealand Warriors. Kiwis, New Zealand Islanders, everybody be happy with that one. Even Aussies. 14 points is a big ask at 9 minutes left on the clock. Exactly, man. I think that the game's been given to the Warriors. That's why the Warriors did it. That's why they did the kick, bro. They do. They knew the difference. Evening, well, afternoon for you. Hey, Mel, it doesn't matter for me. Evening for you, afternoon for me. Glad to have you here as always. How are you doing? I'm sure you're happy about the scoreline right now, aren't you, Mel? I'm sure you're very happy with the scoreline. It's something where the Warriors fans can celebrate, certainly. And, oh, Newcastle Knights nearly mucking up the short kickoff here, managing to just barely collect. And, oh, the referee. The referee. He's, yes, yeah, serious. Tyson Gamble with the ball. Oh, it was a high tackle on the night. Okay, Legends. The Newcastle Knights winning a penalty. High tackle on him. How has your uh, week, how have you been, Mel? Have you been okay? Have you been healing? I'm sorry that things haven't been amazing for you in terms of health at points. So hopefully things are better right now for you, uh, Mel. Now, Conga to Adam Elliott to Gamble. Back over to Ponga. Thomas Jenkins now. Thomas Jenkins now with the sidestep here. Then Thomas Jenkins stopped by by the New Zealand Warriors defence. New Zealand now looking to keep him back. Holding him over. Caelan Pogga now. Caelan Pogga with the dummy. Caelan Pogga, the New Zealand Warriors, guys. The Warriors, mate, what a spin there. A little bit of dance moves there. Everybody dance now. Du, 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 du. If only they had scored the next try and not the Warriors, I would have had so much hope for them in this attacking set here. Miss some of the games who are watching on Sky 8. You should, Mel. You should. You you won't regret it. Oh! Speaking of, you won't regret it. You won't regret turning on the television for that one. Newcastle Legends. Bradman Best. They're going to have to make it quick here. Bradman Best scores. 20-10. to 10. 10 point difference. Oh, yes, says William Hunt. Oh, yes, baby. Here they come. They're on their way back, Legends. Could be 12-20 in a second. They've got to race this. The clock against them. Newcastle Knights, everything on the line. Could the shocker be on? Bradman Best goes over for them. The Warriors switching off in defense. Getting it out of here. Hopping along. Brilliant. Bradman Best, give that man a buddy. Give him a buddy with a try like that. Beautiful. Beautiful. Hey, come back. Can we reverse it? The Uno card. Uno reverse, bruh. Six minutes to go, guys. Caleb Ponga. He's got the kick. He's got the conversion. And he's got the ability. He's going to be chasing that fullback spot for Queensland this season. So at 20 to 12, he's going to want to make a difference here. Okay, Legends. With six, and, with six minutes to go, or technically, you know, maybe like five minutes and 40-something seconds to go, can they do it? Come on, one more try, Knights. You can do it. You can do it. 
You can do it, Knights. You can do it. You can get it done. Come on, Newcastle Legends. Now, Saifiti. Saifiti down the middle here. Jack Braley holding him out. Oh, this is close. Yes, it is, Omar and around. It is close! Newcastle running! Newcastle running! They're running the field! Caelan Ponga back over! And the Warriors knock it! And it's going to be... It's still going to be Newcastle's ball, surely. It could have been a try for Newcastle if Warriors didn't defend so well. And now, the Knights, guys. Momentum with them. They have to score in the next couple minutes if they want even a chance here. Hold on, Waz. You need to hold on. You're desperate, man. The Newcastle Knights are coming at it. Says Omar Zara says, GG's. Never mind. Well, mate, you know, nothing's done yet. I mean, 20-12, to 12, they should win the Warriors, but I've seen comebacks before, Legends. I've, I've seen comebacks before that have surprised me. Tuala, he's waiting for the ref to let him feed it in there. The ref's like, hold back a sec, mate. Newcastle, back to Frizzell. Tyson Frizzell through here. 25th grand final rematch was, was over. Hype slow. Mate, the 2015 grand final rematch 100% was over. Hyped. But, mate, at least it was a, you know, it's a good game to remember what it once was. They won't, lol. Mate, come on, bro. Come on, bro. I know they won't, but is it really so unlikely that you're going to tell the fans that they can't cheer for their team at home, bro? Seriously, you know? I've seen Parramatta come back from 16 points in eight minutes, bro. Okay, down. I've seen Parra do that. You know, and people probably told me when I was hopeful for Parra then they won't. The Knights won't come back, legend, likely, but the Wires can hope. If they don't score here, it's alive. Yeah, and they're not going to score here, so it's, yeah, they're not going to do it, bro. It's GG's. It's GG's. Even if they were to get a try, they'll be down by the two points by the end. The Warriors should be enjoying their win now in this one, mate. They should be enjoying it and having a blast with it. Celebrating all the way. Toru Harris. Harris forced himself to the 40. Nah, Penn. Nah. Nah, bruh. Adam Fanua Blake, bruh. Passes backwards. To Toru Harris. Mitch Barnett. Mitch Barnett stops. May got tripped over. Well, they're not going to give it, bro. They're not going to give it. They don't care. They don't care about it. I thought so. Obstruction? Mate, they probably should have given a penalty there, but the referee just doesn't seem too focused to me. Congratulations to Mel. I don't know if it makes a difference, but it should have been a penalty. Now Jack Cogger. Cogger over the left here. Anari Tuala. Tuala now. 70, 79. We've got three minutes to go, Legends. And the Newcastle Knights, even if they were to get the next one, should be done. These refs, man. These refs. I'm, I'm so done. <laughs> And Crossland, all good, bro. Hey, I've seen worse spam, man. I've seen worse spam on this stream. You're good, Omar. You're good. Three or four comments is fine. It's when people fit, comment like 10 times in a row and it's the same one word or message. William Hunt says, oh, no. Oh, no, no, no. Crossland knocking the ball on, legends. No, 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 no. Uh, if, honestly, the Warriors might even score again. The Warriors might even just go over for the heck of it again in this one. It's over, I reckon. Congrats, the Waz. Yeah, it is over, man. Congratulations to the New Zealand Warriors on the win. Three or four minutes ago, there was a small chance, but now nah, the chance is gone, bro. RTS now. Egan. Back over to Mitch Barnett. I'm out here. See you in the next stream. Mate, I'll see you in the next stream, Omar, bro. Hopefully the next stream we get a little bit of better decisions from the referee, bro. Added for Noah Blake. The, the Knights holding Adam Fanua Blake back into this one, Legends. Now Wade Egan here. Egan back to Tohu Harris. Tohu Harris now. Tohu Harris, the Adam Elliott's working with Frizzell. Tyson Frizzell, man, the only one of the few players that's actually really put in that correct amount of effort today. With Pogger, I think Pogger's done it. I just, I just think a lot of Knights aren't good enough or just aren't doing it right now. Warriors. I was expecting a try there with the way they came in, but Pogger and Bradman best with the heroics. We're entering the final minute 
of the game right now, legends. Get ready. Final 60 seconds. Egan now holding back Poga. Now to the right here. Adam Elliott. Pre out of six now for me, damn was. Let me see what the uh let's let me see what my tips are so far. So I tipped Pampers, that was wrong. I tipped buddy I tipped buddies though, so that's one right for me. Uh oh my god. I tipped two. Three. Okay, yeah, gotcha. The Waz actually helped me. Now I'm free from six. Now I'm free from six. Hopefully I can be four from seven with the war with the Sharks and the Raiders. So I'm free from six. Oh, the kicks. Bradman Best now. Back over and oh, it goes back to Dallas with ten years of Lesniak. No matter what the Knights try, they cannot get one over here, Legends. They can't do it better. Now Marcelo Montoya held down. Three, two, one. Ding, ding, ding. Oh, what a big, big, big. Rada, da, 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 da. The New Zealand Warriors have bested the Knights. Most saw it coming, but the Knights certainly gave us a better chance than many fought. This is good Sunday game, nevertheless. I'm good to see y'all later. See you guys in the next stream. But long, guys, puts me in the points. Mate, you finally got a point, William Hub, by tipping the wire. Finally, once correct for you. Oh, God, if you got every game except that one correct, please tell me, William, that you didn't tip Para. I don't want that bad omen on my side. <laughs> Legend, please don't put that bad omen on my side. <laughs> anyway, Legends, make sure you like and subscribe if you enjoyed. Legends, we're, we're very much on that road with our growth level. Thanks for watching. I'll see you guys in about not too long now. Let's, uh, let's actually take a look here. I'll say the exact time until we go on to the uh, next stream. About 14 minutes, Legends. I'll see you over for the next one. 10 likes already on that one. You guys must really be a fan of your Sharks and Raiders, right, guys? Okay. Yeah, I'll see you over there, Legends. Thanks for watching. Absolutely incredible. All right. Better luck next week, uh, Newcastle.